What's up, guys? Jay Little here with some more years for Thursday, uh, but a very special years for Thursday because I just happened to get me something a little unstable. That's it being unstable. Stop it. Stop it. Um, this is one of the, I guess, undecks or unsets that MTG Wizards of the Coast has uh, put out. Uh, the first one was Unhinged, I believe, which was 1998. So this is the 25th anniversary of that. No, nope, it's not. It's the 20th. Uh, I thought I said 1993, but it wasn't. Uh, but 20th anniversary of Unhinged, at least. Uh, and then on what was it? What was next? Unglued came out in 2004, I believe it was. Um, again, you know, these are kind of like joke cards. These are not term tournament legal. Terminant legal. Uh, as you can see, there's a uh, mad scientist there. He's got he's got a little key cat, little key key, um, and it has some cute little words here. Let's read it, shall we? It says contraption viability testing. Uh, formats tested. Draft check. Constructed check. Uh, tournaments? Nope. Not legal. Silver borders. Uh, these cards cannot be used in any kind of tournaments. Unless you're just having like a fun tournament. You could have like a draft tournament using just these cards. Uh, commander? Question mark. Oh. Uh, Two-headed giant? Then right here it's like three-headed giant? Nope. Five. Uh, and it says note solve for maximum head capacity where x equals deck surface and y equals mass of giant then results uh success finally after 13 years of tireless research my work is complete they said i was mad they said stable contraptions were a pipe dream ha i laugh in the face of such limited thinking the framework for contraptions was staring them in the face and the fools were too small-minded to see it Stability irrelevant. Did I say that word right? Irrelevant. 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 I put the V where the L was and the L where the V was. Why bother with such things, trifles, uh, when the unstable contraption was there waiting for a truly inspired visionary to conceive it? Now they will discover how wrong they were. Now they will rue the day. They question my genius. With my initial test complete, I must redouble my efforts. The full implications of this work must be discovered and documented. Expendable test subjects will be required. So, since this is yours for Thursday, and I got a whole boxy box right here, what I'm going to do is uh, a little bit of a guaranteed giveaway. Uh, now, most yours for Thursdays are like a 1 in 8 or 1 in 10 chance of actually getting a Mythic. Uh, somebody can look back on my yours for Thursdays and figure out exactly what the what it was but uh, i got some unstable here and i'm not sure if they're doing this for each of the new sets or what uh, but they have like a new little display case for the boxes they might just be doing it for this one since there's no fat packs or anything uh but look how neat that is you could like do like you could do one of those Fold it in half so you can have it on a table and people walking on this side of the table will see that they can get a pack and this side of the table can get a pack. And I think, yep, uh, I guess it's not really a poster as such. Oh, I ripped it. I'm a dummy. Get that plastic shit off. I'm not going to read all of this. Uh, if you can see it and want to pause it, Go right ahead if you need to read it, if it's in high enough definition to do so. But not gonna not gonna go through all that. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm catching a cold, but it feels like I am. Uh, but anyway, what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna open up as many packs as I need to get a mythic. Uh, once I get that mythic, I'm gonna give it away. I'm gonna stop opening packs right there, right then. Uh, to win the Mythic, all you have to do is comment, like, and be a subscriber to my channel. Comment and like this video and be a uh, subscriber to my channel. And then at random, I'll pick out the winner uh, of the Mythic. Now, there's some really cool Mythics in this uh, in this thing, uh, including a Urza Planeswalker that I do not want to give away, but I will if I get it. You know, I'm not gonna be I'm not gonna be an asshole and not give it away, but I'd really like it for myself. Uh, there's also a couple sets that, you know what, 
Normally I dump these cards out when I get them, so I'm going to do that, but then I'm going to put them back because that was, first of all, that was rude of me, especially after they were so nice to uh, reimagine the box and make it more neat and tidy. So I'm going to put that back there, and I'm going to put this back in here. There we go. See? All not really back to normal. But anyway, uh, I'm going to give away Mythic. Uh, now with the unstable sets, as I open these uh, for this video, I'm going to just go through the commons and the uncommons. Oh, also, they have new full art tokens, which are really nice. Look at that, it's full art 4-4 angel token. And on the back side, it's foil angel token. But that's really sweet. I kind of like these. I also know that uh, the lands, the full art lands, and hopefully you get one in every pack because... They are now running two dollars and fifty cents to like three or four dollars online. So essentially, if there's one in each pack, and I spent ninety bucks on this pack, even if they're all the two dollars and fifty cent ones, I pretty much made my money back just from the full art lands. But anyway, I got uh, Capital Offensive. I'm not gonna read through all these. Uh, you know, hopefully I'll get a mythic quick so I can read some of these cards on my normal pack crackers. Uh, but I got just desserts and subcontract. Then I got Shaggy something camel. Oh, it's just a line, I, I guess. Uh, Wileen test subject. All, also, there's um, different sets uh, in this that are, for example, the everything in a jig. There's five different everything in a jig. So each one has like three or four different uh, abilities it can do. So it's pretty sweet. But I got a Mother Kangaroo, a Mad Science Fair pod Project, a Novella Mental, Novella Mental. I get it because it's elemental, but it's a novella. Uh, what was this? A Lobe Lobber, Slain Mantis, Side Quest. And my first rare is an Animate Library. It's four and two blue, Enchantment Aura. Enchant your library. Enchanted Library is another creature on the battlefield with power and toughness, each equal to the number of cards in it. It's still a library. If Enchanted Library would leave the battlefield, exile this instead. So that's actually kind of cool. So you're, I mean, again, these are not tournament legal, so I don't think you can actually use these in a tournament. Uh, but if you're playing just, you know, friendly game and you decide to bust out your unstable deck, you can put that out and, you know, on turn, turn... I guess it would have to be six, so you open up with seven, so you have at the least 53, uh, plus six, uh, would be 47, you could essentially have a 47, 47 creature out there, until somebody destroys it, and you're like, fuck, oh, got an island, this is actually the most expensive one, this is like three or four dollars, so I'm really happy I got that, like I said, oh, there's also some of these, the, uh, uh, full art contraption things, and I got two of them. Not sure if that's what's supposed to happen, but it, it I guess it did. Uh, I got Top Secret Tunnel and Jamming Device. Top Secret Tunnel is uh, whenever you crank Top Secret Tunnel, target creature can't be blocked this turn. And whenever you crank uh, Jamming Device, creature's target player controls gets minus one, minus one to one turn. There's no mana cost. I'm not sure if these are free or if there's... If these are tokens or what they are, it must be tokens. So yeah, I got sweet uh, two dollar. Uh, I got like a three or four dollar uh, land card, full art land. I love the full art land, by the way. It's awesome. But did not get a mythic yet, so that's what we're gonna do now. Again, uh, once uh, you see I get a mythic, and if you want it, you can uh, comment and like this video. Uh, be a subscriber to my channel, and you have a chance to win at random. I got go to jail. Big Boa Constrictor. Uh, it gets that it, it that gets left hanging. Chipper Chopper, Mer Man, Mer Man. Uh, willing Test Subject, uh, Adorable Kitten, a Target Minotaur, Proper Laboratory Attire, Laboratory. That's my first uncommon. Overt Operative. Zamba, ooh, this is uh, one of the cards that are like the BFM, the Big Furry Monster. Uh, if you know, I think I think that was in un Unhinged. No, that was Unglued, maybe. I don't know. But anyway, the Big Furry Monster, which I have both parts of, 
is a uh, my laptop. I went to screensaver. Uh, but if you get both both pieces, uh, you can use those to uh, make a 99.99 creature. But it costs like 15 mana to do it. And my rare is the countdown is at one. Uh, three and two red, it's a sorcery. Players play a magic sub-game, starting at one life and using their libraries as their decks. For the rest of the main game, if a source would deal damage to a player who didn't win the sub-game, it deals double that damage instead. Alright. Then I got a mountain, full art mountain. Got a fairy airy. Ooh, that's a mythic. I'm not sure if this counts as the giveaway or not, because I'm not sure if these are actually tokens or what they are. Um, so I'm going to get on my phone right now and figure this out. Hold up. I don't think it does, but I'm going to double check. <clears throat> so, you know, bear with me here. Uh, but what it is, is whenever you crank fairy airy, uh, create... Two one one blue fairy spy creature tokens with flying hasten whenever this creature deals combat to a player. Draw a card, exile them at the beginning of the next step. Next ten step, I should say. So I have to look up unstable MTG. You know what? I'm not gonna count this as the mythic. I want an actual mythic card. But I am going to still look this up here real quick. Uh, do, 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 do. Beedy, bop, do, beedy, bop, do, beep, 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 beedy, boop. Where is Unstable MTG Wiki? Oh, okay. So I'm going to actually open up another pack. I'm going to keep this aside. If I find out later on in the video that this is the mythic, that's the one I'm going to give away. But I don't think it is, to be honest. Didn't really read too much about, uh, read too much about it, to be honest with you. Uh, boo boo doo, boo boo doo, boo boo doo, boo doo, boo 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 doo, boo doo boo boo. I'm still looking it up. So you know, if you gotta go get a drink or something, maybe go potty. This is probably the best time to do it. Cause I'm not sure what's going on here. Did find out uh, I can understand that those half card things you can combine them make like half shark half zombie or half shark half whatever <laughs> <laughs> All right, you're back from the bathroom, so we're gonna open up this. Was I humming the Mission Impossible theme? I feel I was. So we got uh, Common Iguana, Snickering Squirrel, a box of free range goblins, uh, Spell Suck, uh, Blurry Beeble, Wild Crocodile, uh, Chivalrous. Uh, sh Chevalier, Mad Science Fi Fair Project, got one of those already, Sly Spy, Aerial Toastmaster, Rhino hyphen something, uh, Serpentine hyphen something, uh, Full Art Planes, Targeting Rocket, Applied Aeronautics, and Fairy Spy. Not a Full Art one, but still one. Got a Planes though. I really like these uh, full, art, full Art Lands. I'm assuming so far I got one in every pack. I didn't read about my rare on that one, did I? Where to go? Where to go? Where to go? Okay. It's uh, half of Serpentine something. It's Creature Worm. Whenever land enters the battlefield under your control, comma, depends on what you put next to it. It has Augments. Uh, you can pay two and a green. Uh, reveal this card from your hand. Combine it with target host. Uh, augment only as a sorcery. All right. Augmentation. Ooh, got a full art something. Full art something. Clue. Full art clue token. That's pretty cool. Set that aside. And let's see what else I got here. Bumbling uh, Pangolin. Pangolin. Steady handed mook. 
That sounds racist. Uh, Hammer Helper, Shaggy Camel, Magic Word. Uh, Wild Crocodile, Success. Uh, Target Minotaur. Hammer Jammer. Druid of the Sacred Beaker. Half Squirrel, Half Who Knows. And my rare Graveyard Busybody. Uh, four and two blue. Laptop shut off. Uh, four and two blue. Uh, human Spy. All graveyards are also your graveyards. Okay. Uh, graveyard, busybody's power and toughness are each equal to the number of cards with flavor text in your graveyards. That's cool. Got a full art swamp. And I got a boom finger and a twiddle stick charger. Need to know more about them contraptions. So I'm going to take another quick look, see? Uh, yeah, sure. Do 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 do. It's going to show me all. The, I don't want to know all the cards. I just want to know what the contraptions are. Okay, I'm going to go to Wikipedia. They seem to know a little bit more about it. Or Magic Wiki or whatever it is. MTG Wiki. As I open up another pack. Uh, Fairy Airy may, be, may or may not be something that I give away. We'll find out. Uh, I got uh, Pan Paniac. Sacrifice play, dirty rat, multi-headed something, uh, timeout, shaggy camel, willing test subject, target minotaur, entirely normal armchair, looks completely normal, kindly cognition, spy eye, and I got a rare jack knight. Uh, it's one and a white artifact creature cyborg knight. It's one one, and whenever another target, whenever another artifact enters the battlefield under your control, put a plus one plus one counter and jack knight. If that artifact is a contraption, uh, jack knight gains life link until end of turn. Still trying to understand contraptions here. Seem like they're more tokens than anything. I got a rare contraption, a record store, and busy biz, buzz buggy, and a foil storm crow, and full art uh, forest. So I got one of each of the full art lands: forest, swamp, plains, mountain, island. Uh, I'll read a little bit about record store, I guess. Whenever you crank record store, look at the top X cards in your library, where X is the number of artifacts you control. Put one of those artif one of those cards into your hand, and the rest on the bottom of your library in, in random order. So there's that. Let's double check the uh, unstable here. Um, crank, I guess. No. Uh, Agents of Sneak. Oh, okay, the little symbol is the. Uh, I'm I'm assuming like guilds. This is Agents of Sneak. Set details, flavor. Uh, themes and mechanics. Let's see what that's about. Contraptions and assemble. One of two flagship mechanics of the set. There are 45 contraptions, nine with each faction's watermark, or roughly one fifth of the set. Uh, contraptions are artifacts that start the game shuffled into a separate contraption deck. When an effect assembles in a, a contraption, uh, that player takes the top card of their contraption deck, puts them into their first, second, or third sprocket slot. Okay. Uh, so I'm assuming these aren't these are essentially tokens. So I'm not giving away the fairy airy. Sorry guys, sorry boot that. I want a real mythic for my fans, not a not a token mythic. I mean I guess it's not really it. I mean I don't know. But anyway, I'm gonna give away a real actual mythic card. Is what I want to do. But I got a hammer helper. Go to jail. Ordinary pony. Uh, Wall of fortune. Eager beaver. Chivalrous chevalier. Uh, amateur aut. Our author, Buzzing Wackadoodle, uh, Crark's Other Thumb, uh, Hammerfest Boomtacular, I got a Foil Finder's Keepers, and my Rare Over My Dead Bodies. Four and two black. Uh, it says it's an enchantment. Uh, creature cards and graveyards can attack and block as though they were on the battlefield. Can block or be blocked only by creature cards in graveyards. Are zombies in addition to their other types and have undeath touch. If they would deal damage to a creature card, exile that card instead. Okay. Uh, creature cards in your graveyards have haste. Full art forest. Then I got hypnotic swirly dice disc. Thought that was knee and not a C. 
uh, then a dictation a quillograph, and I got a fairy spy, regular art. Rego arts, rego arts. All right, just drop that on the floor, why don't I? All right, next one. Yeah, here. Uh, is looks like a little uh, Guy Fox. Oh, almost. I mean, obviously he didn't have that hat, but the mustache at least is fox like. I think that's his name from the thing. Ooh, I got a full art boar token. Very nice. Very nice. Then I got a selfie preservation, uh, subcontract, bumbling pangolin, uh, adorable kitten, a little kitty cat, timeout, mother kangaroo, novella mental, voracious vacuum, socketed sprocketeer, or sprocketer, not tear, midlife upgrade, clever combo, and my rare is spike. Tournament Grinder. Then I got Forest and Deadly Poison Sampler and Applied Arrow, something or others. Uh, but Spike Tournament Grinder uh, is two and, ooh, two Phyrexian manas. Uh, you can use those e either with a black mana or two Phyrexian uh, or two life per that, um, per each mana, so four mana or four life. Then you can pay four black Phyrexian mana, choose a card you own from outside the game that has been banned or restricted in a constructed format, reveal that card and put it into your hand. Not too shabby. If you have one in mind, I guess. If you don't really have anything like that, like I don't. I couldn't tell you what's banned in constructed or any other format. Uh, sacrifice play. Uh, dirty rat, you dirty rat. A box of free range goblins. Uh, spell suck. Uh, defective detective, squirrel dealer, shaggy camel, secret base. Ooh, that's a land. All right. Uh, stamp of approvals, super duper death ray, party crasher. My rare is handy dandy clone machine. Uh, three artifact, pay two and tap, create a two two colorless. Uh, homon I hate this word. Homunculus creature token. It must be represented by a unique hand and two fingers at all times, or it ceases to exist. What? It must be represented by a unique hand and two fingers at all times, or it ceases to. Uh, whatever. A full art swap. <clears throat> I got another one of those. Put that there. Uh, I'm separating the full arts because, like I said, <clears throat> I looked up online and apparently the full art swamps is that a full art? No. Uh, the full art land, I should say, are worth between two dollars and fifty cents to four dollars. So even if I got thirty-six two dollar and fifty cent lands, that equals what ninety bucks, I think. If I'm not stupid, I might be stupid, but. I just go five by 18, 50, 40, 90. Yeah. So even if I just get those, I paid for this box anyway. And this the box just went up. I bought it like a week before it went up $15 in price. So go me. Unstable. Open this on up. And get a chipper chopper. Uh, finders keepers, feisty stegosaurus, and dinosaur, sweet. Uh, hazmat suit used, crafty octopus, ground pounder, old guard, secret base, druid of the sacred beaker, half squirrel, half hmm, knight of the widget, and my rare is the big idea. Four and two reds, uh, legendary creature brainiac villain. Uh, you can pay two and either a black and red or a bl and a black and red or red what and roll a six sided die create a number of one one red brainiac creature tokens equal to the result tap three untapped brainiacs you control the next time you would roll a six sided die instead roll two six sided dice and use the total of those results nice and for our planes we got headbanger um, awesome tag team in WWE in the late 90s, early 2000s. Mandatory friendship shackles. And Stormcrow, not full art. That's okay. Still looking for that mythic, guys. I'm opened what, like 10, 2, 4, 6, 8, 9, 10, 11 packs now? Should be getting one soon. Go to jail. Finders keepers, just desserts, riveting rigor. Crafty Octopus, Joyride Rigger, 
Ordinary Pony, Be Beast and Show, Entirely Normal Armchair, Steel Squirrel, Old Fashioned Vampire, and my Rare Mythic is a Rare. Very cryptic command. This is one of the ones that have like five different versions of it. Uh, I'm not sure if it's A, B, or C, or D, or E, or F. But it's one and three blue instant. Choose two, scry three, uh, or create a 2-2 two -two black rogue creature token with menace, or add or subtract one, or one, what? from a number of number word on number or number word on target spell or permanent until end of turn that's confusing or return all artifact target players controls to their owner's hands then the full art island that's the most expensive of the uh, full art lands i think could be wrong then got a sap sucker and a gnome ball machine and goat so I'm glad I'm getting uh, full art lands for everything in every pack here. Boop, boop, boop. And oh, we're at 27 minutes almost. 26, I guess it is. I got a, a clue token full art. Very nice. I got Chipper Chopper, Hosted Hireling, Paniac, uh, Magic Word, Joyride, Rigor, Success, Crafty Octopus, Amateur, Autor, Swamp of Stamp of appro Approval. Damn it. Not Swamp of Approval. Uh, rumors of My Death. Old Fashioned Vampire. And my Rare Mythic. Ooh, here we go. We got a Mythic. We got a Do It Yourself Seraph. Uh, it's four and two white. Uh, Cyborg Angel, which is awesome. Uh, it's four, four, flying. Uh, whenever Do It Yourself Seraph attacks, you may search your library for an artifact card, reveal it, then shuffle your library. Do It Yourself Seraph has the text box of each card exiled with Do It Yourself Seraph in addition to its own. I got Full Art Swamp. Uh, treadmill and top secret tunnel. You know what I'm gonna do? You know what I'm gonna do? Not only am I gonna give away the do it yourself serif, as I said I was going to, I'm also gonna give away one of your favorite uh, full art lands. I'm gonna throw that in with this unstable. So, what, what I need you to do, I need you to like the video, comment. Sorry about the glare, it's not really. It's not good, um, but uh, comment on the video, uh, like the video, and if you do those two things, and you're a subscriber to my channel, you're going to be entered in uh, a random drawing, which will end next Thursday when the next Year's for Thursday comes out, and if you win, you win the uh, Do It Yourself Serif and one of these uh, Full Art Lands. Now, what I need you to do is tell me in the comments on the comment that's required I'm trying to get the glare out which one of the five lands you want whether you want mountain forest plains island swamp you can look up look them up online i think the island one is the most expensive i think but don't take my word for it but i'm going to give you that to you now if you didn't <clears throat> excuse me excuse me excuse me moi, uh, if you didn't leave a com if you didn't leave the land you want in the comments then I'm just going to pick which one to give you. But you get your pick. You could, you know, go for the plains since it's, uh, you know, a white card. Or you can go for the island, which, again, I think, not 100% sure, is the most expensive. The swamp is probably the coolest looking one, uh, I will say. Uh, but anyway, it's up to you. So comments, tell me which uh, land you want in the comments. If you win, I will give this to you. If you don't leave a comment, um, or if you don't leave the land that you want, I'm going to give it away randomly. Uh, now, the winner of this, uh, I'm going to ask you to email me your, your name and address so I know where to send it. Obviously, I'm going to need your address. I'm not going to use it for anything creepy that you know of. Ew. Uh, but, uh, yeah, that's all I ask. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, keep on watching and i'll keep on being unstable win a mythic bye